I was using my new stack of one inch N52 rare earth magnets to separate black sands from uh, a sample of pay dirt and I noticed something remarkable. My black sand was pink. As I looked closer with a magnifying glass, I noticed that the pink material was actually garnet sand. I looked it up on Wikipedia and it turns out that garnet quite commonly has a significant amount of iron uh, trapped in its matrix. These aren't impurities, it's actually part of the crystal matrix. And these uh, high power magnets are just barely strong enough to pick it up along with the uh, magnetite of course and the hematite. So this was kind of interesting. I did not expect that garnet sand could be separated from blonde sands by using a magnet, but evidently it can. Here's some that I've purified out. I'm putting it on a, a plastic holder so that uh, I don't mess up my magnets. And as you can see, The garnet sand is picked up by the magnets. It's actually a little bit more magnetic than quite a bit of the um, um, hematite. So that's really interesting. So if you're ever using really powerful rare earth magnets to uh, separate the black sands from your uh, pay dirt, don't be surprised if you pick up some garnet with it. I hope you found this interesting. As always, thank you very much for watching.